Hi everyone and welcome to the second episode of my Arrow video channel. Today we're going to look a bit at Donnie Darko. It's a 2001 movie directed by Richard R. Kelly. It stars Jake Gyllenhaal, his sister Maggie Gyllenhaal, David Chase, uh, the kid from Ring, the American Ring, Patrick Swayze, Jenna Malone and Drew Barrymore and Seth Rogen in a small part. This is one of my favorite movies. I rented it at VGS when it came out and I was just blown away because it's so strange and different and mysterious. The story is um, this young man played by Jake Gyllenhaal, uh, Driss, yeah, here we have him. There is an uh, accident, a plane engine crashes through the roof of his house. He survives, but he's having strange visions of a, a bunny, uh, a big uh, bunny man uh, called, who's called himself Frank. And Frank has a message. Here we have Frank. It's a really creepy uh, suit. And uh, here we have um, Jake talking to him. He has a message from the future that the world will end in uh, a specific uh, set of days. And uh, so this is a movie, it's about teenage angst, it's about coming of age, it's like a drama, thriller, mystery. It's, uh, yeah, here we have like one of the visions Jake has. It's maybe a time travel movie, it's a bit of a romance and uh, what I like with this movie. We can start with a theatrical cut. It's it doesn't really explain that much to you as a viewer. You have, you have to come up like with your own idea, with your own thoughts and uh, try to like figure out what's going on. As the movie progressed, you get more information, but these are just like uh, pieces of a puzzle that you have uh, to put together yourself. And it's a really good movie. Um, and um, later on, uh, the theatrical cut was released oh sorry the um, of course the director's cut was released uh, it's a little bit longer it explains more it has like more um, confirmation you could say about what's going on in the story and uh, what i like with uh, with this edition or like with that theatrical cut that i popped in is that I actually like the theatrical cut better. It doesn't explain as much. You have to like make your own idea and uh, make your own decisions really what's going on with uh, Frank and, and the visions. Let's have a look at this edition. As I said, this is the two disc arrow edition. As always with arrow, you have the logotype. Uh, you have the reflection because it's shiny. You have the color bar and you have the uh, you have the Yuka rating. This is rated 15. And here you have the, the new exclusive arrow cover. It's Frank the Bunny. And um, if you open it up, as by now, you should know, you got a booklet. Uh, there isn't always a booklet in the arrow editions. But uh, in the like special edition, in the nicer editions, and yeah, some other editions as well, you have uh, you have extras uh, like a booklet, and uh, yeah, this is basically a making of. And uh, let's see if we can find some more photos for you in this one. Yeah, here you have a picture of uh, the bunny suit, Frank the Bunny. This is, as I told you, the two disc edition. Uh, I can show you the artwork on the disc. This is the director's cut. Let's put that away and let's look at the edition. Yeah. Uh, usually I flip the cover for Arrow, so I get the new one. I did it with this one. I might as well keep the original one because it's really good looking. This is, um, yeah the characters in a movie and uh, made into like a Frank the Bunny suit. And as always, you have lots and lots of extras. You have making of, you have interviews, you have uh, commentary tracks. And actually, we could just have a quick look at the special features. Let's see. Yeah, my head is a bit in the way, so I'll just move a little bit so you can have a better look. 
you have interviews, you have making of, you have trailers, you have a lot of stuff. This is a two disc edition. So there's different extras on, uh, on different discs. And uh, let's have a quick look actually how much longer the director's cut is. It's uh, 20 minutes longer. The theatrical cut is 130 minutes and the director's cut is 130 team. 33 minutes and I must say I really enjoy when they put out a director's cut or an extended cut that it's actually longer and some cases you have uh, Extended cuts that aren't just that much more uh, They just like added one scene or something like that. This is uh, yeah This is a really good movie if you haven't watched it start with a theatrical cut think about it talk about it with your friends and uh, when you watch it, then you can uh, go ahead and watch the director's cut. As I said, it's a little bit longer. It explains a bit more. Uh, but it also has some fun scene that wasn't included in the theatrical cut. If you watch this movie, I would love to hear what you think about it. If you prefer the theatrical cut or if you prefer the director's cut. And uh, if you like this movie, I hope to see you soon again. I will have another video out in a week and uh, until then see you soon